My name is David, I'm a third year dental student, and we are gonna be reacting to some oddly satisfying teeth videos. Removing braces. This is one of the most satisfying things to watch and to feel. All my friends that had braces, whenever they got their braces off, said it might have been the most satisfying feeling in the world, putting their tongue on their teeth after all those braces were gone. It's also so satisfying to watch. Also the sound from the plier that opens up the brackets, super satisfying. Look how good the tops look! Then they have to shave off whatever, whatever glue is left on there. So they're just going in there, cleaning all that up, polishing up the teeth, making them feel nice and smooth. So when she finally puts her tongue on those teeth, it's gonna feel absolutely amazing. Look at that. That's beautiful. All right, so what they're doing here is they're putting in what's called a bonded permanent retainer. So this is for people after they get braces, normally we're given a retainer that can come in and out. For a lot of people that aren't so consistent and forget to wear the retainer at night, this is a great option because it's gonna hold your teeth in place for a very, very long time. Ooh. What they have on top over there is called a palatal expander. And this is for people where their top jaw is a little bit too narrow for the bottom. Honestly, it sucks for whoever has one of those. It's, it's painful, it's, a, it's not fun. But once it's gone, teeth look great. And your bite is right. So if you have to get these, bear with it. It's gonna be worth it in the end. This doesn't hurt at all. They just take a little, a strip that's a little bit rough and they shave off a little bit on each edge of the teeth so that there is enough room to move all the teeth together or all the teeth into the right places whenever you're getting braces, Invisalign, or anything like that. So here we're looking at what it's like to get your teeth whitened at the dentist. And what we do is we take a high concentration of carbamide peroxide or hydrogen peroxide, and this is a much higher concentration than anything like a strip or a gel that you can find over the counter. They put that on your teeth, they have you sit down, isolate all the areas, put a light on it, that makes it work even better. And at the end, they have to clean off all of that gel. Now the teeth might not look so white here, but it actually keeps working for a couple of hours, even up to a day after you leave the dental office and get the procedure done. Wow, they did a good job. So now after they took off all that gel, they're taking off what we use to cover all of the gums so they stay safe and clean and healthy. And look how much whiter it looks from here now that they took that, that white piece off. So one of the reasons I'd recommend going to a dental office to get your whitening done is first of all, they need to check if your teeth are healthy. Because if they're not healthy and you whiten your teeth, you could be in a lot of pain. And the most important thing is our health, right? Those videos were so satisfying. My name is David. I'm a dental student. Hope to see you guys next time.